I had a day off. Uh, I think I was in Milwaukee. Uh, I, like I went for a walk and I was just like, damn, I'm like, this is it's happening. Like I'm here, I'm back. Mic check, one, two, two, three, four, five, seven. The first game, it was just, it, it just happened, right? It wasn't, I wasn't like, I was excited, but I wasn't like overexcited. Like it was just like, I'm here. And I, I actually felt like it was just another game to me. We went from that first game in New Orleans and we left and went to another city. And that it was just, I was on a road trip. I was in the thick of a road trip. The game has definitely evolved. It's faster, younger. Uh, the game has definitely sped up a lot. Uh, so you, you know, you you gotta you gotta adjust with the times, right? And and uh, I think that's the most important part that I was kind of focusing in on is being able to adjust uh, with with what's happening right now. I think being able to play with somebody like Dame and. CJ and just in general, like guys who you cool with, those guys make the transition so easy uh, to just come in and, and, and just fit right in and play and be a part of something. They made me feel wanted. to the Strainers Hospital, see those kids in there, like it, it, it definitely puts everything into perspective. Like whatever you're going through is nothing incomparable to what those kids are going through in there. So if they can smile, then there's no reason why you shouldn't smile. Definitely feel, you know, the, the, the appreciation, uh, the love, the support, uh, which which really makes this kind of this journey uh, a little bit more fun. It makes it easy, right? It it, it, it keeps me going. It motivates me. Um, so I, I would just say thank you, and it you know that support doesn't go unnoticed.